an annual expo, Science, Technology and Innovation, dedicated to the Scientific Workers' Day, opened at the Mongolian National Modern Art Gallery. Minister of Education, Culture, Science and Sports, Mrs. Togdalma, delivered remarks at the opening ceremony of the event, which aims to introduce new discoveries and achievements in the sector, share information, and to give report on the works carried out over the past year. Nearly 1,500 innovative products of the top 120 scientific organizations in Mongolia, including 35 public and private academic institutions, 25 startups, four government agencies, and 18 joint projects are being displayed at the expo. Particularly, the participants are showcasing books, booklets, preventive drugs, plant and animal-based foodstuff, building materials, biohydrates, energy and mine rehabilitation technologies, wood and cashmere products, as well as information technology products. A large number of projects worth 15 billion Tugriks are carried out annually in regard with putting the scientists' work that contain scientific, technological, and innovative benefits into a production. Employees of the Computer Graphics and Multimedia Research Laboratory of the National University of Mongolia invented a device that allows people to see seemingly real gods by virtualizing the images of certain gods. They also developed a virtual reality training system for mining industry. We have uh, virtualized eight god figures created carved by Undergig and Zanbazar as in the nature and people can make a tour around them. Moreover, we have formed a virtual training device for mining companies and patented it. The device was given to the Bagnor mine and now we are planning to make one for the Erdinet Mining Corporation. Our products are low in price compared to the similar ones made in the USA and Australia, and we can further improve the device as we are its creator. Armona Corporation presented insoles and shoes that fully match the physical features of Mongolian people. Our shoes and insoles are designed in accordance with biomechanical rational based on the anthropometric studies of Mongolian's food. The shoes can prevent from shoe bites and other food problems associated with the footwear. In order to bring public services closer to the exhibitors, organizers have provided free medical examinations and professional advice through the one-stop services of the municipal departments of tax, customs and social insurance and the intellectual property office. The top exhibits will be selected on November 23rd.